Good morning. So I had mentioned that I use a reverse RIAA filtered CD to test phono stages. Now, one of the things we're going to have to do in order for this to work is we'll have to knock the level down from the CD player because remember, CD players generally put out about 2 volts. And most phono stages are down in the millivolt range. So I use this little volume control that I picked up. Um, it's basically nothing more than that, just a volume control in a box. And it has RCA ins and outs on the back. So I just put the CD player in the in and take the out and run it directly to the phono input. And then I can play my RIAA reversed CD through there. And I can see what the, what the phono stage sounds like. So in order to do this, I use Audacity. Now Audacity is an open source free program and it has a lot of rich features. So I'm going to open it up and I'll show you how we can take a file and make a reverse RIAA file out of it. Okay, so we'll open. Uh, okay. This is some YouTube safe music I had downloaded. Now the first thing we need to do is select our tracks. Just click anywhere over here and you'll see the background turns white. And we need to drop the level because when we apply this quite aggressive equalization, it could cause a lot of clipping or overs. So we go up to uh, let's see, effect and amplify. And we are going to drag this fader down about 10 dB, no, 11. And you'll see that it makes the uh, amplitudes very a lot lower. And now we're going to go to Graphic EQ. And we are going to Manage and find the factory preset for RIAA. And you can see it's quite an aggressive curve. We're going to invert that. And then we are going to apply that to our file. And there you have it. Now you can save or export. I usually just export a wave. If you want to export an MP3, you have to download a DLL for this, but we can just export it as a wave since we're just going to burn it onto a CD anyway. So we export as wave and we save it wherever we decide we're going to save it. And there it is. It just popped up right over here. And that is our reverse RIAA filtered file. That's all there is to it. Okay, folks, uh, this is going to be a really short video. So I'm going to sign off now. And as always, I like giving back to the community that has given me so much. Thanks a lot.